we don't know of any other method to get these fish out of where we're working. Unfortunately, it's 142 stairs. On a rainy day in November in the district of North Vancouver, a group is heading down the stairs leading to the Seymour River to catch mature salmon that have returned here to spawn. Fish are placed in dry bags uh, filled with water, which are then closed and put into a backpack, and then they've been hiked up the stairs up to the top where they will go into the hatchery truck. This year, it's especially important to catch fish and bring them to the hatchery because of a recent change in the salmon habitat. December 2014, we had a rock slide, which was about 50,000 cubic meters of rock that fell uh, in the Lower Seymour Conservation Reserve. It created an impoundment, so the river has risen upstream of the rock slide. It pretty much eliminated all the spawning area for coho and steelhead specifically. So if we were to leave them alone, a lot of these fish wouldn't even spawn. So we're trying to get them up to a safe area where we can actually spawn them ourselves and get them in an incubation system where we have a lot better survival than Mother Nature would at this point. The important work done today by all the different groups and volunteers on the Seymour will help ensure that salmon remain a part of this healthy ecosystem.